If your ambient occlusion map is baking out like this, I have a super quick solution that might just help solve uh, this issue for you. Okay, so first things first is understanding what exactly it is you are trying to bake. So I have my high poly that I am baking onto my low poly. So I would just go into my bake settings and I would just do from high to low. So I would do selected to active, so I'm doing my high to low, and then I would just go ahead and hit bake with the bake type being ambient occlusion. And I also use simple bake, so you'll see these other settings here, but this is just um, with blender, or with vanilla blender, this is um, what you'll see. So anyway, you'll go ahead and do that and you'll get the same exact results as this. And issue being is because if you look in your outliner, you could see I have this plain .001. And even though the hide and viewport is disabled, I have it enabled in, in the renders. So when I go ahead and uh, reveal this, you'll see I have this upside down Carnotaurus. And that is also being uh, rendered when I do the baking. So to prevent that from happening, you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and actually disable it in the renders. And you'll notice when I do that, we'll get a uh, clean ambient occlusion bake. Okay, so hopefully now you can see that the bake has come out uh, cleaner and it's not having that black artifacting. And obviously my bake here <laughs> needs a lot of cleanup itself. And personally, I would use a cage um, so anyway, I hope this helps you out. Again, just check your viewport. It's super simple and easily overlooked. So um, anyway, yep, that's it. And I'll see you in the next video.